Screw it. We're doing dovetails.
Okay, so we're gonna try something a little bit new. Um, we're gonna do kind of a uh, what did I learn project recap type thing on some of these videos. Not necessarily all of them, but the ones that need it. And I thought this would be a good one to start with. This was a fun project, a lot of challenges for me being the first time doing uh, dovetails. And I did uh, learn quite a bit. Um, first thing was the stop dado that holds that top board in all the way around. Stop dados on the 45 was really hard. Um, and actually it took me three pieces and then by the fourth one I had my technique down of using the 45 almost just as a marking gauge to establish uh, where the data would be and then finishing it up with uh, the router plane and the chisel. The box ended up being just a little bit too big and to mitigate that I just put some wedges in there. Uh, the wedges are made out of the same cocoa hog and nut wood. Another thing that kind of made the whole sizing and putting everything together a little bit difficult is these DMT stones um, are not square actually uh, from the factory. They are a little bit kind of trapezoidal shape um, all the way around. All three of them were like that. The joints themselves, when I put them together, all of them were perfectly square this direction, but not this direction which meant that uh, the, whole, the whole thing just wobbled when I put it down. So my two options there were kind of to rebuild the whole thing or to uh, just make two of those joints a lot bigger than, uh, I, you know, uh, with a lot more gap than I would have wanted so they could move around and I could torque the thing flat again. Um, all of these have a little bit of filler in them, which was just the sawdust from either the walnut or the white oak uh, mixed with a little bit of glue. Um, but this one right here, I left, this has no filler, no anything in it. And uh, I am super proud of that for my first ever dovetail joint. But um, yeah, it was a, uh, a super fun project. I learned a lot and uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, yeah.